What's going on my fellow Belmonts, it's the Mad Belmont here, and today I have yet another indie Metroidvania slash RPG game that you should know about, okay? This game is called Eldoran, it comes to us from developer Mantra and Synergia Games and from publisher Graffiti Games, okay? Now, in my 2023's The Year of the Metroidvania video, which you can see if you click the card in the upper right corner. I went over what I thought was every single Metroidvania game that was slated to come out this year. Clearly, that was not the case because I missed Soul Passage, which I did a video on. Okay, I did that one yesterday, and if you did not see that video, you can go check that one by clicking the card in the upper right corner right about now. But anyway... In that video, I thought I went over everything, but I didn't. Oh, did I ever not do it? Okay, and not only, and even more so than the Soul Passage, you know, Soul Passage going over my head. You know, that one has a Kickstarter that's coming up. Okay, that one's you know gonna get, gonna be getting funding. This one right here is the biggest miss by me because. Not only is this game slated to come out this year, okay, not only is it slated to come out, it has a full-on fucking release date, and I didn't even know about this game until someone mentioned it in the comments of that video, okay? So, yeah, um, thank you to the person that commented in the video and told me about this game. Greatly appreciate that. So, yeah, what is Eldorand? Eldorand is, like I said, a... Metroidvania slash RPG game with a Lovecraftian theme. It is story driven, okay? Just like Soul Passage, which I talked about yesterday. And yeah, this game is just incredible. You're seeing footage for it in the background right now, okay? Definitely has a cool little gothic style to it. Love my gothic themes in my games, okay? This one has a Lovecraftian theme. I love that. Okay. A good Lovecraftian theme in the game really sells it for me. Really just mm, gets me wanting to play it immediately. Okay. One of my favorite games of all time is Bloodborne. Okay. And that game has a Lovecraftian theme. So love me a good one in the game. And this one definitely has it in spades. Okay. Also, love 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 the fact that we are getting more rpg themed metroidvanias i've been craving this in the indie space for some time okay because castlevania back in the day really mixed the rpg elements and the story elements with the gameplay so well and i'm so glad that there are indie devs out there that are going for it they are going for it and I'm definitely going to support it. Okay, so this game right here comes out February 16th of this year. So, you've got a little bit under a month for this game. Okay, I think about eh, maybe two, two and a half, maybe three weeks uh, from the recording of this video. So, not a long wait whatsoever. Okay, now, the bad part here is as of right now, I do not know if this game has a confirmed console release, okay? I only was able to find it on Steam, and if you do have a PC and you have Steam, uh, there is a demo for the game right now, which you can go and check out. And uh, also, this game, uh, this game does have skill-based combat, so it ain't gonna be easy out here in these Lovecraftian filled streets okay so with that being said i am excited for this game i'm stoked for it okay and uh, i do hope it eventually gets a console release i do not have a pc that is capable of running the game right now because i'm looking at the specs for it and yeah i definitely cannot handle this game okay so i will not be playing it myself but I figured I'd let you know so that if you do have a PC that is capable of running this game, you can jump right on this, okay? So, with that being said, 
Are you excited for this game? Are you looking forward to it? If you are, be sure to let me know down in the comments below. All right. And whenever I do eventually get to play this game, I will be making more content on it. Uh, yeah, so with that being said, have fun on the hunt, my fellow Belmonts. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.